welcome you back to Black Side Sports. Tonight, we're going to talk about the ACC. Is Clemson and Florida State going to the SEC? First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel. Hit that like button. Hit that notification button. But also comment on this video. As soon as we watch the Pac-10 dissolve right before our eyes, it seems like the next conference could be the ACC. The ACC conference gets the less money from television deals. That means Clemson, Florida State, Miami, those who are the top most representative teams in those conferences get way, way less money than what the SEC teams are getting. But the biggest problem they have in the ACC for Clemson and Florida State is that they must buy out their contract. And that's a lot of money. You're talking maybe two, three hundred million dollars to buy out that ACC contract. And will it be worth it for them to move on to the SEC? But you also have the Big Ten who are looking at some ACC teams, possibly Virginia, North Carolina to the Big Ten, Clemson, uh, Florida State, maybe Miami to the SEC. This is what's going on right now. It's a race right now to get to a conference. In the ACC, if they don't cover themselves, they will dissolve right before your eyes, just like the Pac-12. They are going to have to find more revenue for these teams. If they don't find the revenue, these teams will move on, and they will move on quickly. Just see what happened this Friday. You saw five teams in a snap of a finger move from the Pac-12 to the Big T 10 to the Big 12. And you may see this before the end of the month with Florida State and Clemson if they can get a buyout package deal from the ACC, which is extremely difficult right now. The ACC, their conference head, their commissioner, their presidents right now better buckle down if they want to save this conference. It's up to them. But I don't see Clemson staying. I see that Dabble Sweeney really wants to get into the ACC. And I see that Mike Norvell and Florida State really wants to get into the SEC. Because that's where all the action is in. It's in two conferences. It'll basically be three. And once they expand the playoff to 12 teams, there will be a lot of playoff spots for these teams in the conference because these conferences going to be they they they're, they're going to knock some teams out basically losing games. They all know that, but you're going to have a serious serious championship playoff once all these teams settle down into a conference and what I really think they want to do is have all these teams together for the beginning of the 2024 season. So it's up to these college presidents to make financial decisions that they never thought they would have to make at Clemson, Florida State, Miami, Virginia, North Carolina. You still got NC State. You have a lot of prestigious schools who want to get into these conferences. So we'll see what happens. But I'm telling you, the ACC better buckle down because the way these teams are expanding as quickly as they're expanding these conferences, they're eating these teams up and bringing them in like Pac-Man. You have to take this extremely serious. And we'll see what the ACC does because they will still have an automatic bid to uh, the college football playoff once it expands. <coughs> they will be one of the four conferences, the ACC, Big 12, the SEC, and the Big 10. So they will still have that prestigious position, but they still won't have the money that the Big 10 and the SEC is getting, and they're getting huge dollars. It's all about the money. It's all about the prestige of being in the conference. 
it's all about the money. I want to thank you for listening to Black Side Sports. Hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.